My making sense of adulties. It's your boy Radio Rod Rodney Smith with the voice of Reason. Reason. And this is vlog number two. We are headed to drum roll, please. I'm trying to drive. Kansas City. And why Kansas City, you may ask? So my sister plays D1 basketball at Baylor University. And this weekend is their Big 12 conference tournament. So me and, June, me and June June, Juni, Junifer, voice of reason, are driving eight hours all the way over there to go watch her win another conference championship. Anything else to add? I think you covered it all. All right. What's you guys left? All right, friends, after eight freaking hours later we have finally arrived to my homie's house the exhaustion and we're about to go to sleep and we'll see you guys in the morning for an eventful day good morning where are you at uh, oh <laughs> it is a friday morning guys we are exhausted i woke up actually at eight o'clock this morning because I couldn't sleep. I was so excited to see my sister play basketball today. I couldn't sleep at all. But it is a Friday morning. We are in Kansas City. And we're first going to my school because we're going to go say hello to my teacher. I haven't been back to school in like a year and a half now. And I was supposed to go do two events. We're going to talk to children. We're going to go talk to students, not children. They're like the same age as us. You're right. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but we'll catch back up with you guys later. It's your boy Radio Ryan. All right, all dressed to go talk to the students. Looking pretty <sighs> dapper as usual. Ready to go. This weather is not Nashville. This this is not Nashville weather. We are at my old stomping grounds. Yo, this is small but bougie. This is a nice little Catholic school. You might include when they died, where they died, how they died. All righty, we're back. What we a have... time. What a time at the old school, the old stomping yeah, grounds a, of Rodney Smith. What a nice little day, morning, of seeing my old school. That was really cool. Junie got to see, like, my, we got, we got, what? We got to talk to my coach. We got to talk to my old professor. That was fun. That was cool. So it was good to see everybody again. I saw some of my friends, some coaches and stuff like that. That was a great time. But now, the more important event of the day we're going to go see the Big 12 Player of the Year. We are for, going uh, to go basketball. see the Big 12 Player of the Year. And, and what's her name, Rodney? My Rodney? best friend and favorite person in the world, Nalissa Smith, the very own sister of Radio Rod. The blood that gets... side of the road guys because we needed a parking spot <laughs> so he was stripping we have arrived at the gym of course late per usual and it's a nice little wall make sure you have your wallet make sure you have a wallet or uh yeah it's raining out but we finally made it to the stadium i know you see it on me i know you see it on me baby it's more like a you see it on me baby let me see the shirt okay Okay. So we're right outside of the Crown Plaza Hotel. Hopefully this is where my sister's staying, so we can say hello afterwards, so you guys can see her. All right, so we are successfully in the building. The we auditorium. Have, it's. We are in. This is kind of insane. Big auditorium. <laughs> can't see us, but she gonna hear me. In a She'll few. see us eventually. She'll see us eventually. But this is a nice view. Let me turn it around for you guys. We got a nice little view here. Not too far. We finna beat they easily. They just lost. Losers. Uh, See, look, they, they, they practice and putting a hand up. Yeah, yeah, cause they got they better get some defense going on my sis. Yeah! Hey, she saw us. 
I don't see any TCU fans. They put them on the other side. I think they put them on the other side. I don't know where they at. They ain't got no fans over here because they, they know. Purples. Hey, but tomorrow, UT, oh my God. Yeah, they ain't got no, they ain't got no. Hey, how we doing? They don't have any TCU fans over here, so. Well, I guess we're not pissing anybody's parents off, but we will be loud, so. All right, guys, little update. We got kicked out of our seats by Karen. Ultimate Karen. She being an yeah, she didn't like that we were sitting in one section to the right. We were one well, our bad, our too bad. Close to her. And but, she kicked uh, us out of our seat. God, she gives us a lot of nice. I don't even know who she is. Karen. <laughs> Kansas City. Karen. Kansas City, Karen. Big 12, Kansas City. Karen. <laughs> 38-25 guys, halftime is over. We are still winning. Oh yeah, work, work, work. Yup. Yup. Get on TV. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let's see. Big oh, win. I saw you on the ESPN Easy channel. Easy win. <laughs> Easy win. She's down there getting, down there getting the interview. Yup. Nobody wants to see us be successful, you feel me? They can't handle it. They can't handle us, but guess what? Tomorrow, about to be even worse. Whole squad coming in tomorrow. And my boy Jesse, UT. UT, number one draft pick, playing her tomorrow. Supposedly. Jesse coming in tonight. Hex is off. It's a wrap tomorrow, y'all. It's a wrap. Wow, this hotel is insane. All right, the 12th player. <laughs> the 12th player of the year. What? Can we interview you, man? Hey, interview, interview. We just watched you. Uh, we watched you get uh, an oop, a block, and then another oop. <laughs> so my question to you about that scenario right there was that foul at the end? You just need a breather real quick. You just need a second to, oh, absolutely. to compose yourself, get your breath back, to be like, did I really just do that? Absolutely. I was tired as hell. I said, Kim, you I hear you. I 26 and 8 in the game. I probably said the same thing before that. But tomorrow, you got Texas. You too. Big robbery game. Perennial. Number one pick. Charlie, what is her name? Charlie? Nobody cares. Whatever, whatever. You've done her dirty twice. What, what are we supposed to expect for tomorrow? Are we going to get a three-peat? Are we going to run through three, three times in one season? I mean, might as well, you know. <laughs> might as well, you know. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. Tell the people who you are. Introduce yourself. Hello, Tell them that you have an issue. Hey, my name is Xavier. Nice to meet you. Some people call me XSC. What? Including your mother. But, uh, <laughs> these are very real light skin. Yo, this is my uh, light skin friend. Look at him. Being disobedient already. Needs a beard lineup. Oh, you guys have those nice you fancy know, drinks. If you're watching. <laughs> <laughs> he said the nice fancy drinks. Let's have a classic old fashioned with your good old Kentucky oh. bourbon, uh, Woodford Reserve. Oh, top wow. notch. Top shelf. Okay. Yeah. 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 Nothing. <laughs> Nothing. Tell us why you like the uh, the podcast. I mean, we'll it's so relatable. Just to say, you listen to it and you're like, oh my god, that is hard to see. You know? I feel good. Yes. <laughs> and what was your favorite episode you said? My favorite one was the cheating one because it's unfortunate to relate, but I relate it so hard to you know, I made the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> you, you heard it here, folks. Our podcast is the. I tell you guys. <laughs> we have fans everywhere. Okay. Small update on what we're doing right now. So, we have just got dressed and showered. Um, and now we're. Well, Jesse was late. He said his plane got here at 7? 6? What time did he say? He said 6.40. He said 6.40. Didn't get here till 7.40. 7.40. So he lied. So now him and X are on the way. We went to go pick up two bottles of Crown, as you just saw. And we're going to pregame before we go to Yard House. The dopest spot to be. It was a good day so far. We got to see my sister. We got to kick it with her in the hotel. It's been a fun day so far. So now we're going to go out and kick it. Have a good time. Jess and X are on the way. Then we're going to get turned up. Can't wait to show you guys. And big game tomorrow in the morning.
says hello. Oh, you've never seen a vlog? Is, it on? Hey, is this thing on? Is this thing on? It's on, man. <laughs> Sir, I'm vlogging. Sorry. If you don't mind. Sorry. About see today, pay later financing. You are killing me. I was gonna like, have you, you plug in your phone, I am dog. trying to vlog, and you're killing me. I, I get it, bro. Right. All right, y'all. Excuse me, guys. I'm vlogging. Thank you. You didn't bring the bottle. She's the one holding a soda can. You didn't bring the bottle. You the chaser, and not, that's the thing that needs to be chased. You poured we literally, shot. we all took shots and nobody grabbed the bottle. Just forgot the bottle. <laughs> oh, put, put it on. Put it on a freestyle. We got it. We got oh the We got the hook. Keep the camera. That's all I got. Just that's all I got. Just forgot the bottle. <laughs> It's that again for Eric. Just forgot the bottle. Oh! Just forgot the bottle. Oh! Where's our bottle? Nah, hey, because. Because Jeff forgot the bottle. Yeah. Hey! <laughs> but he did forget his soda. Ah! Uh, Looking like a Yoda. Hey! <laughs> What? Sorry. I'll check back in one more time before we go to the bar. This is just how boys trip. Work. Yeah, I'm sorry. This is just how boys trips work. Like I don't, I don't get to see family like that. Yeah, I love you, Adam. You're not here, but I'll one more video, you guys, and we'll and then. What? Oh, I gotta go. Good morning. I don't know what camera to look into. Good morning. <laughs> this one. Out. Big game day, as I said again. UT versus Baylor. My sister versus the number one draft pick. It is about to be a good day. And if we win, guys, I will turn up more than we turned up last night. It is a big game day. UT Baylor. Number one. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. You didn't get a hand, man. Sorry, sorry, sorry. That ass right. UT Baylor. The Today's the game day. versus Baylor and we are about to whoop that again for the third time we got some more Baylor fans right here yes sir yes sir thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you game UT versus Baylor ladies and gentlemen is about to be a good game West Virginia we gonna whoop that ass next uh, but we're gonna start here <laughs> let me see it let me see it let me see it yeah Baby, Big 12, Big 12 tournament, baby. Hey, this is a big game. Let me talk to you. Let me talk to you. Talk to the camera. Talk to the camera. 20 piece, we going. Junie, talk to the camera. Junie, talk to the camera. Talk to the camera, my boy. Woo woo. All right, y'all. It is the end of the. It is the. <laughs> Three point Charlie. It is the end of the third quarter. We are still winning. Baylor, baby. You think I'm not? Honestly, Baylor. It's what? not even fair at this point. It's, it's not, not it's not even a game. Like the, the game. number one draft pick has about the three, three points. points. All right, y'all. So we won. As usual, like we said. They were trying to kick us out. They tried to kick us out, y'all. Baby. At all times. Baylor. At all times. Baby. All time. We had number one. So 24 on the, on 7. The so on the Baylor. Smith Nation, Smith. baby. We like that. Baylor, baby. Y'all, the cops had to walk us to our car. <laughs> Their number one draft pick had 
three points. Okay, let's talk about it. How's three he hooping, points. How's he on the number one draft pick? I think number should go one, number one, honestly. Number one draft pick had three points. That's embarrassing. Anyways, we almost got kicked out. They didn't kick us out because they can't kick us out. We were doing an amazing job cheering. We are the Baylor fan base. We will be here tomorrow. Championship game, West Virginia. We are acting up. So we're out, Westport, Kansas City, right? Is that what this is? Yep. Westport. So we're going to Throwback, which is a really cool bar out here in KC. Good night. Love you guys. Make it sense of adulting podcast. It's your boy Radio Rod. The voice of reason. We'll holler at you guys tomorrow. Later. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It is a championship game day with your Baylor Bears. We here. We here. Let me see it. You know what time it is. You know what time it is. It's that time, baby. 3828. We're winning. West Virginia's giving us a nice little fight, but uh, nothing important. Any thoughts on the game, son? Uh, they're weak. They're weak. Uh -huh. We're hard. better. Mm -hmm. The refs deal. are clearly Virginia fans, but we're not going to complain. But like I said, Baylor Nation, baby horns now. West Virginia, what? Mountain Tears? Not even relevant. We're going to beat them. It's been a good day so far. Big 12. Champions, yes, sir. We expected it though. We knew, yeah. I mean, like we knew it. Nothing crazy. Slight work, just West Virginia. Twenty piece championship, yeah, like easy. We were in their head. Another day, another dollar. Easy money, but now our homie's actually a tattoo artist. I'll show you when we get there. What we get? We or me and whoever else is getting a tattoo. I ain't getting no tattoos. One hour later. First tattoo. <laughs> yes, sir. All right, friends. It's been one adventurous week. Adventurous weekend. Week. Week, weekend. Long weekend. Long Thursday. Draining weekend. Yeah. We're long. exhausted. Uh, we leave tomorrow. Back to Natty Nashville. Get right back to our grind. It's been fun. But yeah, we got a long drive tomorrow, so we're probably gonna cut out early tonight. There's nothing really going on. Boring. Good night. Bedtime. Peace. All right, friends. Family, pets, dead people again. <laughs> dead people get there every time. It is about time to head back to Nashville. It is time. I, <laughs> we are beat. <laughs> we are ready to be back. It has been such a long freaking week here in Kansas. I think I've drank my liver to freaking oblivion. So my we're, goodness, I don't we're gonna take a good break. I don't even think I want to drink until next week. <laughs> Sorry, friends, back home, Nashville. Yeah, no, <laughs> we're that, gonna have to chill I for a bit. It. Guys, like, subscribe, share. This is our second vlog. We're getting off to a good start. We're having a lot of fun. This is fun. This is a lot of fun. It's your boy Radio Rod, Rodney Smith, voice of reason, Mr. Riddle. Like, subscribe, go check us out on the podcast. Follow us on YouTube. Follow us on Instagram. Make it something of Adulting Podcast, baby. We're out. Later. No!